Hi there. Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another Naruto to Boruto Shinobi Strikers video, guys. So today, guys, I got um, as you guys can see, Tachi right here. Um, so it's uh, healing you too. Uh, so as you guys know, the reanimation uh, DLC that came out for Itachi. I tweak it a little bit, change it. Um, I use my own type of builds to make it better, as you guys can see on the video ahead. With that said, guys, hope you guys like it. And if you guys like it, you guys love it, make sure you smash the like button, guys. And let's start with the class. Hi right, guys, we back here. Uh, as you guys can see, it's uh, the healing uh, class. So for we got healing weapon, we have the Itachi Ambu blade. Are uh, we going all Ambu? Um, so here it is, guys. It's a pretty good one. Uh, kunai. Um, some people like the healing seal. Uh, I don't really like it. Didn't do me anything. I like the kunai because when they're like almost about to die, you can throw it, boom, you get the kill. Or oh, it's easier that way. Um, costumes uh, for the costume, we got the Ambu outfit, the top. Um, so you guys can see uh, for the accessories we got the it Ambu Itachi mask on the right side and then uh, for the bottom we got the Boruto outfit is the one that match with the Ambu uh, black ups pretty much so that's why I don't have the bottom one it's too expensive cannot buy it yet. Um, if you guys want to know check my old video you guys will see uh, so for start for first ninjutsu we got the just Jasaka beats. Um, you guys can know the Susano, and then he throws those uh, churning as like a shuriken type of thing. Really good. There's a lot of damage from far away. Really good. Um, for the ninjutsu number two, I have the chakra scrapples. I don't have a lot of. I'm trying to get a lot of yeah jutsus for heal. I don't have a lot, but that's why I went with this ones. Uh, they're really good. I tried this one. Didn't like it. It's you have to be lucky to get it um i tried this one so you have to be super close range not worth it um so i went with this one it's good uh not a lot of damage but it gets you close to your enemies uh pretty much they teleport you press this you go to your enemy and then you deal them the last damage you didn't do and kill them really good um it's a little bit cooldown so it's good with that so for the uh, secret technique, we got the Isanami, you guys already know what it does, pretty much, it doesn't do any damage, uh, just activate it and it teleports you with another one, and then just uh, again Jutsu pretty much, and then uh, after it loads up, you can use it again and it gives you extra damage and it, it takes um, the healing ninjutsu and stuff out from the enemies. Uh, we got the Shadow Clones, it's one of the best ones. I don't have the multi Shadow Clone yet, but the Shadow Clone uh, lives in fighting, it's a little bit cool down, uh, and then you can go and fight back. You can use this one and the same thing, but like it's a longer cooldown. Um, with that said, um, this is my skill trees. Uh, as you guys can know, I always have one man army activated, it's always my main to go. You guys know what it does. Boosts your close range attacks powers. But, uh, bottom skill, clear mind, reduce ninjutsu cooldown. And one, one in one million, shortens ninjutsu cooldown time when an enemy is knocked out. So you have those two reducing the cooldown by a lot. So it means I can use my ninjutsu back to back super fast. So uh, it's already, the bottom skill is reducing my cooldown. But every time I knock somebody out, it reduces it more so I can use my uh, reduces double so that's a good one I recommend and with that said let's jump into let's drop that intro and let's jump into the video hope you guys like it Hey! 
Bale's so good. We got 13 and 4, and I'm using Itachi's uh, reanimation jutsus. Um, you're only using one, so you guys can zone the intro. So, hope you guys like it, guys. Hope you guys enjoy it, and I'll see you guys in the next one.